Right, today um, I'm up to Bangkok, to the British Embassy, um, to basically uh, get my marriage papers in order so I can get married to Nokrat at the Ampor, back here in Konkain. Now there's a sequence of events you have to do to get, obviously to get married. Um, first of all, you probably know that you have to download all the application forms from the internet, from the embassy. You have to fill it in and then you have to have uh, identification, affirmations, etc. I'll put some pictures up so you can actually see what I'm talking about. But the main thing now is getting a flight down to the embassy from Concane. And uh, I booked, you got a book online, I booked online for 2.20 this afternoon. Uh, it's about 7 o'clock this morning now, so I'm going down to the airport. It's only going to take an hour, and then I'm going to get a taxi then from uh, the airport to the embassy. Probably have to hang around a little bit for my uh, allotted appointment. Um, once I've done that, I come out and I, I have all the papers translated into Thai. And that's very important because you need that then to go to the um, Ampor where we get married. And that's about it. So I'll see you at the airport. How old? Typical. <laughs> she didn't know how to find the taxi, uh, how to find the airport. So we've had to jump in a toot toot to get to hopefully a half hour late already. <laughs> Is this wedding going to take place? I ask myself. Okay, well, I managed to get you right on time as they're boarding. <laughs> I thought it was the last, last one or last one now. It's a mad rush, isn't it? They're so laid back, the ties. Nearly, nearly missed the plane. <laughs> okay, well, I've uh, managed to make it. Okay, just arrived. Um, got a quick flight, really. Hour, hour and ten minutes. Um, just arrived now. Just checking out, and that's it. Going to get a taxi now down to the uh, British Embassy. Okay, I got a taxi. A uh, local lad. Um, he basically said, "You want a taxi?" I said, "Yeah." <laughs> so I had to wait ten minutes. But uh, he's going to take me to the embassy now. Uh, he won't be able to bring me back, so I'll have to get a taxi um, outside. Uh, apparently, they're quite frequent outside the embassy, so we shall see. So I'm on my way. I'm nearly at the embassy, um, and I'll speak to you in a bit.
congestion. <laughs> They've even got flyovers going over the main roads here. Um, just have to pay 70 baht then to go on that. Oh. Okay, I just had to give her the um, uh, all the papers and my passport. Um, she's going to uh, get the um, sort of rewritten in Thai, translated. So uh, anyway, so I just waited now for that to come back. Apparently, she's going to uh, come back before I have to go into the embassy itself. So uh, anyway. We'll see now, and then I gotta pay. I think it's gonna cost about four thousand um, baht, which is like 100, 112 quid, something like that. Okay, okay. Well, uh, she actually gave me all the documents back. <laughs> she took a photograph of everything, and then she's gonna go back to the office, get it all translated, and then gonna meet me just before going into the embassy. Okay, um, I'll probably leave the link to this uh, company. So if anyone's interested, they can uh, they can use them, and they seem quite efficient. Uh, she didn't speak much English, but the uh, the lady on the the end of the phone did, so that was good. Okay, gonna go for something to eat now, and uh, I can come back here for uh, ten past two. Just so I day. Do a little bit of sightseeing first. This is the central embassy, which is situated on the corner. Christ, it's busy. I just had a coffee in the Suzuki coffee. Um, nice and cool, yeah. Before I go outside in the hot temperatures. Ooh. Right, as I said, the next stage, uh, I'll be meeting the uh, translation lady with, um, uh, hopefully, I'll give her the copies of um, everything that, um, that I've got um, once the uh, British Embassy has stamped everything. Now it's cost me £50 for the papers and £25 for the um, Ampeter uh, certificate. In other words, um, it's a certificate that we need to take to the Ampeter when we, um, when we get married. Um, apparently some Amputer offices uh, will will uh, marry you without a, this certificate, but uh, the one that we're going to get married in Concain, they uh, they will require one. So that's an extra twenty five pound. So all in all, it's seventy five pound. Uh, the most expensive, of course, is the translation. That's like worked out a hundred and twenty pound. But there are guys. Uh, it's certainly a lot cheaper than. Um, going through an agency you can do it yourself it's simple enough just follow what I've done so far and that's it okay see you in a minute that's interesting guys uh, got the British Embassy opposite and uh, opposite so we got the uh, Swedish so my guess is there's gonna be a few more embassies along this road Oh, here's the thing, guys. <laughs> I tried crashing that road then. It says, uh, you know, sort of uh, 
you can walk across the next thing bloody traffic it almost knocked me down <laughs> I don't think they stop crazy <laughs> Funny little bird. Okay, opposite the uh Embassy is a hotel called Sivalatel. This is the place we go in. This is the uh, yeah, that's a sign there. And the hours, as I said, my appointment's uh, two twenty. It's now two thirteen, two fourteen. So I think I'll make my way in. See if they'll let uh, let me go in now. Okay. Okay, those are the uh, papers, all done. <laughs> and the lady's just uh, going to take these now and get them translated. Okay, I'm just going back to the hotel now. Uh, so going back to the airport I should say um, I got a, a taxi driver who speaks good English so that's a you know a good thing and um, he's a he supports um, Man United boo <laughs> but um, and of course I, su I support Cardiff probably saying if I did support an English team it'd probably be Liverpool <laughs> um, anyway uh, as you can see uh, guys uh, all the um, information which I've uh, put up on screen that's what you need when you when you get married and uh, the next stage now is just wait for the translation to arrive and then when that arrives we can just pop along to the local AMFA which is like a county council hall where you just uh, you get married it's it's really no ceremonies or anything like that you just go in and sign a bit of paper pay a you know a couple hundred baht and then you're married um, then afterwards you could of course have a marriage um, uh, well an evening I suppose a um, wedding evening celebration but I think that might have to wait for me for the moment but um, anyway um, I'll try and leave all the information on the end of the video so that you can see uh, how it's done and as you see it's quite easy one guy I was talking to uh, just paid 20,000 baht to a company to, to, to get his done well I've done mine cheap really it was cost me um, 3,000 with the embassy and 4,000 with the uh, translation of course I had to find my way here on the airport and the taxi but uh, it's a lot cheaper than 20,000 baht <laughs> and it's, it is quite simple to do okay I'll catch you later okay just check in just arrived here so I've got plenty of time to have a cup of coffee we have about an hour or two to get home now. I think that's it, five, which is FD3256. Okay, I'll see you later.